How would you tell the story of what Bloomfield achieved when it was all brand new until we get here where you fight for a title? Yeah, at the, back in May when we basically started meeting with, with the players, uh, it started with uh, a meeting at Lamar's Donuts with, with the seniors and talking through goals and things that we wanted to accomplish and, and being here was, was one of those goals. Uh, on one of the very first players' meetings I had, uh, had a picture of Sports Lurie Field uh, right there on our presentation, and that was, that was our goal. And uh, I've got to give a lot of credit to, to our seniors because uh, they embraced the change, they embraced the newness. I think they were hungry for some new things. There was a lot of uh, respect for Coach Davies, who had been there for a long, long time, but they were they were ready for something new, and they embraced that. And, and for them just to immediately trust what we were doing, uh, paid a lot of dividends in the summer. They'll have the CSU level for team camp and three weeks on the set on seven. And, uh, you know, we stubbed our toes in one against our crosstown rival. You know, the, the new staff and coach playing for the Field Cup uh, week one was uh, a lot of pressure to begin with. But uh, we learned a lot from that. Told the guys, you know, we, just, we don't know what we don't know yet. You guys will figure those things out. And, uh, went into Wheat Ridge uh, the next week and uh, faced some adversity there. And in the second half, uh, the kids came out of the locker room and started, started believing. And then from there, we faced uh, three very tough teams, uh, two of them on the road but with Windsor and then Monarch and then Loveland. And I think the kids really started believing when we came out of, out of those games. And it's just been uh, get better every, 